Yeah. Just, just like, uh, press the good buttons. Where are my good buttons? Okay, hello and welcome to Mutation. This is the game you voted for. Um, this was the game described as strange people living together and mutants. They are mutants living together. It's a narrative game and it should have some pretty cool vibes. Um, came highly recommended and I'm very uh, excited to play this. Thank you very much for joining me on this new venture. This will be taking the place of the first segment for a little while. Um, not voting for the other ones don't mean that they are gone forever. Um, those are games I plan on playing in the future. They will be in future votes. You're welcome. Mario Sunshine music. I love Mario Sunshine. Mario Sunshine got a lot of flack, and I don't know why. It's some top-tier game. Drink your corn syrup, Bimple. I will! I will! Has anyone ever seen the slime cycle corn vid? I have no idea what that is. No. Prologue. Welcome to the journey of mutation. <clears throat> Call me when you get there, okay? Mom. Look, you've got to allow me to work. <clears throat> oh my god. Yo, you think the coffee's gonna help me? <clears throat> Look, you've got to allow me to worry. It's part of the job. I'm proud of you. Stay away from the kitchen, okay? I want to come back to a nice, not burnt down house. I have all those uh, frozen meals you made. They're labeled by day of the week. Oh, when did you get so grown up? I love you. Hugs. Love you too, mom. Yo, you notice how I'm trying to pull things back for stream so that it's not just like violence all the time. <laughs> this is a good way to start a game. I don't see any mutants. I mean, give it a, give it a moment. Some of the shine missions were pretty ridiculous, but I do like the environments in that game. Dearest Gaia and K. Is it Kay or Kai? I'm gonna go with Kai. It's time. You cannot allow this rift between you to linger. He's dying. Terrible thing to do alone. Please come. Much love, Mori. What's uh, what's that you've got there? Graubert. I like a Graubert. Uh, just a letter. The ink will wear out if you keep reading it so much. The sea ain't a place for letters, girly. Um, that's not actually how letters work. It's a place for adventures! And you're about to have one of the rarest of them all. Full of mutants and monsters, there you go. And terrible things, huh? Impulse description of this game made me remember that Dead of Daylight. As a dating sim, yeah. You shouldn't talk like that. I can talk how I like, little lady. Those mutants and monsters are known to me. But no counting on how they'll talk to a stranger. Or how they'll take to a stranger. You're the first outsider to visit in nigh on 20 years. You need a nickname. Something to make you seem nice and friendly to the natives. Uh. Hmm. Uh. I don't like nicknames. I don't like. Sea Crumb! Nice and cutesy. Uh. 
change the subject. The sea is very relaxing. I might, you know, head out on deck and listen to it for a while. Suit yourself, sea crumb. Remember, there was a whole parkour that drove me and sister crazy because we struggled so bad. We got there in the end. I wouldn't mind doing a sunshine playthrough, but I know that that wouldn't be as interesting for chat, maybe. The secret courses were terrible if you don't have flood with you. Hard disagree. Can't, can't, I can't agree with that, Jared. I, I love you, but those, those secret missions without flood were some of the best best thing ever missed them i wanted an entire game of just that like just hardcore um mario 3d mario platforming no no gimmicks and i love flood don't get me wrong i know i'm kind of disturbing the vibes of this game i'm sorry for future people watching but um yeah like i, I would love just a very stock uh, kind of like Mario platformer and those secret missions were just like uh, uh. you would get flood back and there was a tie in red coin challenge yeah indeed there was no it took that away yeah you'd have to do them I, I, I hundo percented sunshine yes I got all of the blue coins the blue coins get a lot of hate and I don't know why I, I think it's partially because a lot of them are not as, like, significant as uh, the shines, but they're basically the same as collecting shines. Um, stranger to me is when we got to Mario Odyssey, pretty much they replaced the blue coins with just more shines. Like, all of the moons in Odyssey are basically the same as collecting blue coins. Um, and there's so much just, like, nothing content in Odyssey. It, it didn't feel as, like... I don't know. Significant as some of the the missions in in Sunshine. I like I like Odyssey fine. Yeah, the Chuckster level. I I will say the Chuckster level is bad. I would I would not defend the Chuckster level. All right. Well, this expired a decade ago. I don't know... Am I using keyboard and mouse? Okay, it's keyboard or mouse, but not both. Some of this cargo smells weird. The blue coins were put in spots you probably wouldn't even think to look, which is probably why people hate them. <laughs> I mean, uh, some of the moons in, in Odyssey are much the same, though. Like, ground pound this hill, ground pound that hill. Don't think I need one of these right now. Ooh, spooky. Whoa, you, you know me. You're not real. Karu. I must be dreaming. Do we want a nice spooky voice for this character? I'm getting one set up. The salt. Whoa, that's maybe too spooky. Hold on a second. The salt of the air, the sting of the breeze, you know these things, you know me. You look so real. Hurry. Wake up, Kai. You need to hurry. Wake up. It was so fun to search for them. Oh. Bad dreams, Seacrum. No, I... Full of monsters and mutants, I bet. It's in the waters. Sure. What's that? Can't hear you over the song of the sea. Nothing. So, looking forward to meeting your grandpa? Uh, yeah, what's he like? I gotta stop touching the mouse. Not so lively these days. But way back when he was a fierce... Way, way back when he was a fearsome man. Especially stern about a bit of harmless smuggling. 
Uh, go out on deck now, and you'll see her as we approach. Land ho. Oh no, I didn't see you. I'm so clumsy, I'm sorry. Don't worry, I'm always tripping over myself. I'm just a big green lump, always getting in the way. You can say that again. Uh, um, you're Kai, right? Yeah, you. Oh, uh, I'm Tung. Um, uh, Claire's son. I think our mums were friends. So you're Mori's grandson. Right? Yeah. You should come back, to, uh, come to the bar later. People hang out there and, uh, ah, uh, uh, come on back to work, my lad. Sorry, but I gotta get on with this. Mori's in the square. She'll be expecting you. That's where all those lithium car batteries ended up. Man, all those custom animations everywhere must have taken an, e an eternity. For sure. Mm. Oh, I'm sorry, dear. These arms are stronger than they look. I'm just so happy to meet you. I'm Mori, an old friend of your grandpa. Um, nice to meet you. But enough of me. Are you ready? Um, of course. I'll take you to him. Grandpa? Oh. It's still ticking away. Don't you worry. I didn't mean to wake you. I thought you'd never make it in time. Explain. I came as quick as I could. Of course. For heaven's sake. I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. I have wanted to meet you for so long. Yet here you are. And all I can do is lie here. Useless. Uh, be funny. You couldn't even put up a welcome to mu mutation zone, uh, banner? Eh. Uh, mm. Well, that's some Dora in you, to be sure. Grandma? Let us not talk of the past. But what a joy it is that you have come to me. Come to help me. Be responsible. Let me know anything I can do, okay? You must tell me about yourself. Um, let's talk about friends. Oh, I don't know. I'm just me. Okay, at school, good at sports. I'm captain of the swim team. I normally like doing stuff on my own, so the team is good because I get to hang out with people. And, uh, and your mother? No, no, no. Oh, that's Nano. That's who we're talking to. You're close to her? Um, be generous. No, be honest. I think we're both people who like to be alone. But in a nice way. I see. And now I have the pleasure of your company. I bet you've heard a lot about this place. Uh, I guess. I've never met mutants before. 
Indeed. Well, don't whisper the word like it's an insult, girl. It is in some mouths, but not in ours. <laughs> the bed is far better than in Stardews. Oh! Grandpa? Can I get you something? I'm not having a good day. Forgive me, I need to rest. But please go and find my old friend Yoke. Yoke? In the archive. He has something for you. Can you do that? Anything else? Can I write in... Can I write it in my journal? I used to use it to keep track of tasks and chores and stuff. It is very important. You are very important. Grandpa? Okay. I love this game already. I figured that this would be a good game. I, I'm getting kind of a vibe of what kind of games suit stream best. And also, I mean, I, I've been wanting to try this game for a while. Weird herbs and things for cooking. I guess this is the bed Maury made up for me. Now there's a Stardew bed. Check. Open journal. Mom's old friend Claire is here somewhere. I should find her. Tongue said people hang out in the bar. Grandpa told me to find Yoke in the archive. Apparently he has something for me. That's some nice handwriting there. Stairs temporarily closed to, for repair. Do not use them, Dennis. Turn the game up a bit. Yeah, we got some jelly beans. Uh, hold on. It's all about consumer demand. Not this again. Right now, the crossing is always two days a week, right? I'm scared of the sea. Full of monsters and things. But it, if we could develop a singular, a single user vehicle. One time I heard Spike saw a mermaid. People could go whenever they wanted. Just imagine all those teeth and claws. What? I said, just imagine all those teeth and claws. Have you ever seen a mermaid, Sal? No. No. Because I'm smart enough to stay away from the sea. Uh, okay. Mm, jelly beans. Back in a few minutes, alien. Yo, I like this music a lot, actually. Something I really appreciate about um, the main character is like how plain looking I, uh, uh, she they are like I, I was um i wanted to talk a little bit about this but maybe now is not the best time but i've been playing a, a couple of games recently and uh, you know sometimes i feel like protagonists can be very overly designed neat tick neat tick do um sorry i'll get out of your way I wanted to read that. Hold on a second. These fraying wires seem totally safe and not at all like a fire hazard. Wait, can I talk to those, uh, gumballs? Oh, mom told me about you. Dots, right? Nip, nip, uh, nip, nip, nap. Nap, nip. Nip, nip, kick, kick, nick, yep, ah, uh, yeah. Okay, sorry, I didn't, I didn't mean to make you lose your count. Yo, my hungry ass will last long on this island. Oh, oh, oh. 
error, try again. Okay. Bow, 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 bow. Bibbidi boo. Bibbidi boo. Oh. Are you here to hear my fish cake song? It's very famous. Fish cake. Catchy. Catchy, catchy. Catchy the fishies. I'm glad you like my song. Spike does not. Spike went into the bar over there to uh, get away from my darned nuisance. That doesn't seem very nice. Spike is my friend. He lets me make drinks sometimes. But he is not a friend of OPEC singing. Yo, it's the California Raisins. <laughs> That's a reference I have not heard in a long time. Are those still a thing? I haven't heard about the California Raisins in forever. Did they get it? Wonder if mom and grandma ever sat here and looked out at the sea. Pow, pow, pow. Pow, pow. Giant bug head. Sure, why not? Do, 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 do. Oh my goodness! You look just like her. Claire, right? <gasps> oh my god. Instantly starts crying. Yes, it's Claire. Mom talks about you a lot. I don't mean to. Oh gosh, I feel so silly. I don't know why I'm crying. I'm so happy to meet you. Offer help. Uh, should I go get some tissues? No, no, I'll get a hold of myself. Sorry. It's just, it was such a sweet, wonderful time. Seeing you walk up to me after all those years. It just suddenly brought it, brought it all back. And now I can't stop. Please just leave me for a bit. Go and find Aelin in the square. She's lovely. She'll be on her break about now. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, I, I really like the environmental designs in this game. This thing has seen better days. Back. California Reasons got cancelled on Twitter and never showed up again. Oh. Interesting. <clears throat> Maybe they'll get uh, reborn, like the, the peanut. You, know, you guys know about the peanut? You know about baby peanut? Yeah, baby peanut's a thing now. <clears throat> we have to we have to share the planet with the baby peanut now. Ugh. Truly, I, I detest that peanut. Wonder who lives here. Come on, heave ho! Oh, I'm sorry, Kai. I have to finish up here. Darn right you do. Come find me this afternoon in the yard behind that building there. I'll be working on my- If you want those supplies I fetched for you, you've got to earn them. Um, later. Oh, oh, oh. Do, 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 do. Ba, na, 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 na. Here, this is half buried. Weird, seeing stuff from b before the meteor. Was this a highway? We're hearing things about a meteor. Do, 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 do. 
He's a peanut in the top hat and monocle. Like baby tomatoes? No, like baby shark do 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 baby shark do 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 DMCA do 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 Copyright claim do 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 Nice thing about a game that you can play with just the keyboard is I can uh, you know I my my other hand is free for coffee Someone's gonna make that weird. I really just like holding my coffee. Lullaby. Funny name for a boat. We're looking for the archive. That's the tiniest lighthouse. What the hell? It is quite the tiny lighthouse, isn't it? Morris Morish. Morish? I guess like Morish, but with Mori. Nice pun, Mori. Mori's Morish. Oh. Kai, my love. You've caught me in my natural habitat. I'm usually here cooking up something yummy. If I'm not tending to the garden where I grow all the veggies. It's a bit late for lunch right now, but come back if you fancy a bite tomorrow. Should I take anything for Grandpa? Oh no, don't you worry about that. I keep him well supplied. Oh, but I've got so much washing up after all that. A simple stir-fry tomorrow, I think. Have you had a chance to get to know our tongue yet? Um, uh, tall green guy lo loads boxes. Oh, and Claire is dying to say hello. She's in the harbor with her shop. Yeah, I mean, I tried. Looks like they need a bit of water. Those peanuts are good. Uh, like, Mr. Peanut? Yeah, Mr. Peanut is now Baby Peanut. I'm surprised people don't know about this. I guess it's good that they don't know. Because then the advertising is not working. Oh my days! Kai, honey, welcome. It's so lovely to see a fresh face around here. Welcome to one of the most beautiful places on Earth. Well, I think so anyway. Are you... I'm Aelin, and this little one doesn't have a name yet. It's half me and half Growlby, so who knows what to expect. Uh, the, the guy who sails the ferry? You don't sound impressed. He's not much of a listener. But he's very caring when you get past that. Oh, before I forget, you must go and see Claire. She was your mother's best friend, and she's dying to meet you. Explain about the crying. I think I might have upset her. Oh no, I bet she cried. She was so worried she would. It's nothing personal. Or, actually, it's because she loved your mom so much. She'll be alright in a bit. You might not feel like it yet, but you're coming back to some family history here. In a good way, I hope. Lots to explore. There's the archive. This is where Yoki, Yoke works. Yoke is a mole. Some kind of marmot. Nope. I don't know. Can't tell actually. He's a muppet. Is what he is. Could it be? Kai. Uh, what's this place? Welcome to the archive. A fine collection of objects and writings are hidden herein, including my writing. Some very important research, if I may say so myself. Research? Certainly, investigating the history of here and hereabouts. For years, it has been my aim to collect everything I can. Archives are vital places to record culture as well as fact. Uh, be earnest. Sounds really important. I'm glad you think so. But to purpose! I am supposed to give you this. 
Plus one encyclopedia. Flora of Mutation. Um, a book? The encyclopedia contains detailed information about the plant life or hereabouts. The flora of Mutation, starting from seeds. A collaboration between me and your grandfather. Which we are both, uh, quite proud of. Interesting, thanks. I gotta go for a bit. See, see you soon, Mimi. Um, thanks. I believe he wishes to cultivate your interest in these things. Do have a look inside. In the meantime, thank you for paying our uh, paying our humble archive a visit, young lady. Feel free to have a look around and ask me if there's anything you're curious about. Do do do. There's some wildly retro stuff here. Yo, is this a mannequin wearing a VR headset? Always important to wear your scuba goggles, just in case. Good day to you, friendly mannequin. Not VR goggles. Scuba, scuba goggles. Oh, that's where it came from. I want to check out some other stuff real quick. Oh, no, no, never, never mind. There's nothing else here. Let's open the encyclopedia. Flora of Mutation. Thanks to Yoke in particular, Manny always. I began this catalog of the Flora of Mutation as a way to collect what Manny had taught me coming from a scientific background. Oh, sorry, what Manny had taught me. Coming from a scientific background, I had the urge to catalog to systematically pin down and define the new and wondrous flora of my new environment. But before long, I came to understand that the nation of order we like to consider as implicit in this scientific method is a fallacy. Order is a social, not a natural construct. What right do I have to decide the proper name for a thing? I keep this record as a reminder of my journey as I try to understand how to pass on the gifts given to me by mutation. Always question. Algae fern? Uh, soil, swamp, and moist soil found towards the east of mutation. Alga fern leaves. I guess this game was a plant uh, passion as well. It's thought that this chimera of a plant who spe arose specifically after the coming of moon dragon, having properties of both algae and ferns, producing reddish leaves without cell nuclei, a quality of alg alg algae, and green leaves with them, a quality of ferns. Algae fern is able to thrive both in extreme sunlight and in dark shaded areas. Algae ferns can be eaten or served as a tea to reduce inflammation caused by diseases or injury. And Arcadia appears to have toxic qualities when planted too close to other flora. Arrow hat. Raft spiders use the numbing effects of the spores to prey on larger insects. Astral ragwort. Succulent with thick, dark gray protuberances. It can adapt to many forms of harsh soil. I'm assuming that, um, well, there's a lot of plants in this book. That is a lot of plants. All right, I'm assuming that it's going to be important. Two B word seed, bear weed seed. So are we collecting plants now? Vogelberry. These ruins feel more recent than others. Got a little creature here, critter. Piccolino seed. Not fern spore. It's a spore, a bit of the island. Vogel means bird in German. Some of these stones have little 
faces on them. Creepy. Huh, all arranged in a circle. Temple fern seeds. Wow, this is incredible. Hmm, it looks to me like there are some shapes on the rocks. And they're gonna match these shapes up here, and I'm gonna need to match those shapes maybe in the future. Interesting. I think I'll save exploring until I know my way around the village better. Okay. Testing the limits, like where where can I go? Okay, let's go talk to Claire. Actually, have I been in here? I have not. Well now. How's it going, Jitterbug? Kai, right? Uh, be funny. Nope. International Women of Mystery. Occasionally disguise myself as a cargo crate. Can't say it's a very effective disguise, but there you go. Now that's a mighty fine joke. Spike, you don't have to say it's funny. Just laugh. I'm um, Mew. I'm sorry for him. Oh, I get it. Mew, like a cat. Haha. <laughs> talk to... Talk to Mew. Nice to meet you, Mew. Sure. Mew is our resident hunter and punk rocker. Spike. Oh, you're gonna tell me it's not punk rock, it's sludge core or something. Spike. Um. Whenever I hear people talk about music genres, I feel like an idiot. You and me both. But hey, Jitterbug. You let me know if you need anything, okay? can't tell from my manner of speaking, I was an out-of-towner just like you. It was 20 years ago I landed on these particular shores, and I still sometimes feel like a newcomer. It can be a mite overwhelming, but we're all friendly folk. Yes, I think you'll get along mighty fine here. Mighty fine. Ah, it is now the afternoon, and so now I can go and talk to Claire. Hey there, Jitterbug. Ask him about the nickname. Is that some kind of insect? Kind of dance from the olden days. I'm sorry if it's a bit familiar. It's a habit. I used to travel a lot. It was a way of trying to make friends. Grudgingly accept it. Jitterbug is better than sea crumb, at least. Eh. You remind me of my Mew. Same spiky sense of humor. She's gone, gone home for a cat nap right now. Anyway, you gotta get... Gotta be getting on with smartening the place up ahead of this evening. Make sure you pop along later. Yo, was that Jack Black? Hi, thanks so much for coming back. I'm okay now. It was a bit much after all. I just wanted to say you're welcome. 
why did why did I make you cry? It's just uh guy has had such a full life. And I sometimes worry. Seeing you makes me feel like I don't go on enough adventures. Which is silly because I don't even like adventures. I like what I know. Right. But enough of that. Let me show you to my shop. I've got all kinds of things here. Fruit, veggies, meat, fabric, furniture, pearls, cutlery. Uh, I don't have any money. Oh, we trade in goods, not money. Everyone puts things in and everyone takes them out. It's more of a central store, I guess. But you won't need anything while you're here. Everyone will be queuing up to give you what you need. Is it really so rare to have visitors? The last visitor we had was Spike. Oh, well, maybe Graubert. But he comes and goes so much. Spike arrived here when I was a teenager. He was such a mysterious stranger. He runs the bar over there now. Uh, anyways. Cool, so the shop is for trade. Really, it's just a way to pool our resources. And I keep the inventory. I'm very good at math. Speaking of which, can you do me a favor and go tell Gel A their order is in? I've got some potash. Who now? Gel A is a bit funny. I think they came from a different process than, like, humanoid mutations. Yokei tried to explain it to me once. But they're just the same as the rest of us, really. And they're a very talented scientist. They make all of our perfumes and soaps and things. Just head deep into the cave. You'll find them right at the bottom. Okay, sure. Uh, it's for chemical for plants. What is this? This is mutation. This is a, um... I wouldn't say it's necessarily a point-and-click adventure, because that implies that there are puzzles to solve. It's more of a kind of narrative-driven little story. I have to go in... Oh, the cave. I see. Hot ash. I don't know. Sweeting. Sweet thing, the readings just won't improve. That's why I'm not able to spend so much time with you and your pipe. It's the bedrock of our whole ecosystem. But I'll make it up to you, I promise. I'll bring you some nice crispy blue bugs as a treat. How about that? Sweet thing. Please talk to me. More jelly beans. I'm just saying. You're always just saying. There's a market opportunity out there. The metrics are dire. Perhaps we need a new productivity matrix. What are you working on there? Maybe we need to update our metrics. What's a market opportunity? A gap in the market. Market. Is that manure you're shoveling? Grab's currently got a monopoly on ferry crossings, but he doesn't have to. That's a market opportunity? It would be. It is! If we actually lived in a market economy. That settles it. Let's reformat both the matrix and the metrics. I guess you don't want to talk to me. My one gripe with this is that it feels very similar to third segment. I, I don't know. I think there's going to be even less um, gameplay in this game than there is in Spirit Fair. Ooh, mushroom. Two lumen hat spore. Big enough to crawl through, but way too filthy to try. 
Those raisins would be crypto bros. You're not wrong. This doorway feels weirdly organic. Wow, we stepped into the 50s or something. 60s? Check out this purple crystal. Second generation biological outcome. Yes, I am rather impressive. Although less optimal at the present time. Uh, what were you just doing? I have to acquire my nutrients from the earth. I must spend part of each day recharging as you might when you sleep or eat. However, for some time, the quality of the soil in our biome has been degrading. Uh, offer help. Can I help? I need means of supplementing my nutrition. Hold on. Supplements? I do not fully ascertain your meaning. Explain. My mom always makes me carry vitamin pills. She says with all the sport I do, I need extra stuff. It sounds like what you need. Negative one vitamin pill. Intriguing. It seems parental care includes the supplementation of organic compounds required for normal growth and nutrition. Gratitude. You're welcome, Chell A. Oh. And Claire has some uh, potash for you. I was supposed to tell you. Understood. I will now assimilate these resources. That voice reminds me, when do we roll up humans and light them on fire again? <laughs> we can do a bit of, we can do one round of that after this. Um, let's see, what time is it? I'm gonna do, say, like, uh, another, like, 40 minutes of this. And then we'll do a round of Katamari, and then I'll round up stream with some spirit fairer. Why do I have an urge to hit these big old pipes with a hammer? Ba 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 ba. That banging in the background when the song starts freaks me out every time because it sounds so real. But I think it's happening in real life. Yep, I'm adding this to my list of weird insults list next to the mouth breather. Oh, um, hey. Uh... Nice to see you not welding- wielding any boxes. Are you kidding? Or are you actually annoyed? Kidding. Maybe it was weird to ask. I'm just pretty terrible at reading people, I guess. Um, sorry, start over? Oh, okay, sure. So, um, this is my boat. Be positive. Looks very boaty. I figure I could do with a ticket to freedom. It's nice here, in theory, but, uh, it's also just jungle and family. Talk about freedom. I get it. It's like learning to drive in the city. Yes, exactly that. Uh, so you were brought up by your mom? Uh, be honest. Not always. I mean, I've had to bring myself up a bit. It's just me and my little brother, uh, Toby, and her now. But it's only been like that for a couple of years. What happened to your... Uh... There was an accident. 
my dad left. I know it's bad, but um, sometimes I think I'd feel better if he if he died. It wouldn't have felt like it was our fault. Jesus. Be charitable. I guess I can understand that. This boat was my dad's. He had a proper boat, too. That's what he left on. He used to call this his little runabout. I guess it makes you think of him. I guess. Time to work out what I want to... What I want it to be. We are in the evening. It's plus six wild grass seeds. Don't know what we're going to be doing with that yet. Bow, bow, bow. Oh. Let's check out the bar. See what's up there. What, play, what place isn't improved by a fish flag? Right? I want a fish flag. Maybe I need to uh, change up the vibe of my stream. I kind of like this vibe, you know? Like, uh, kind of like down... I wouldn't say downtrodden, but like, you know... Um, I don't know how to put it. Rustic is such a tired word, but, you know, something like that. Like, my stream is uh, is being projected from a boat kind of thing. Pretty, I wonder if the colors are important. Where's the bar? Define vibe. You mean background theme? Yeah. I think the I think uh, I'm I'm tired of the uh, the like ancient OS look. Oh, I passed the bar, which means I'm a lawyer now. <laughs> Look, our little sea crumb has graced us with her presence. Honey, indoor voice, please. Always the sea. What's that, little man? If I spoke like you, I'd call everyone my little ventilation unit. To be fair, Grob. To be fair to Grob, the sea is a bit more picturesque than plumbing. Uh, I have a voice for this guy. This is gonna get confusing very quickly. Hold on. That's not the voice. Waste disposal and infrastructure management. You need to loosen an loosen anchor a bit, matey. You see? The sea again. Always the sea. You need the sea, matey. It brings you all them weird thingamabobs for fixing things and stuff. Someone get me another rum. I'm sure whatever you design will be great. I appreciate the vote of confidence. Having fun? Uh, serious work there? Yep, yep, yep. Getting ready for her tongue. We're gonna have a match. Doo -doo -doo. I always feel like uh, I'm a little bit worried I'm always going to miss something. Seems like there's a lot going on. This place, this game is uh, doing a very good job of like creating a world. It feels very lived in. There's tongue. She was looking really, what's the word? Lovesick? Maybe it's the hormones. I remember when I was pregnant with- Mom! I know, it's none of my business. But, oh my goodness, of all people, him? She loves him. Love doesn't protect you. I mean, just think about what happened to you. T 
Tong, how's your boat project coming? All I'm saying is that you have to consider what kind of father your child is going to have. Was she looking, uh, really looking, um, lovesick? Join in, sure. Who was looking lovesick? No one. Mom is just gossiping. Kai, dear. Maybe she's having second thoughts. All okay with Nono? Um, he seems pretty ill. Let us know if you need anything, okay? I know you're only just, you've only just met us all, but you're not alone. So what you're saying is she deserves better. Hmm. Let's go check on No-No. I'm sure he's fine. Okay. You were in my dream. You were out east by the temple. And a great bird picked you up and carried you away. I tried to shout, but you were... You climbed up into its wings. And you flew it back down to safety. I first met Manny at the temple. I learned so much there. Who's Manny? One of those dreams that is so vivid you can feel the starlight on your skin. I'm dying, Kai. Sorry, what? I know you know this theoretically, but you need to understand it, actually. Why did you say you needed me, then? I know, I know. I didn't ask for you to watch me die. But it is happening. It is something I have come to accept. He must, too. That way, we will not waste time. So why am I here? I want to get to know you. And I also want you to get to know the people who are part of me. To know them is also to know me. Talk about the past. I was supposed to be at a swim camp, you know? This summer I was going to a regional camp, like, I was picked to go. But then Mom got this letter. She said I should meet you. I've never seen someone die before. I've never died before. It'll be an adventure for both of us. My last great adventure. What's next? That dream. I wonder if you could go to the temple and see if there are any flowers you could bring back for me. I miss the outdoors. Um, you know, potentially grim topic for a game, but I mean, it's an interesting, you know, what's interesting to me is what's darker, a game that treats life as uh, disposable and uh treats of violence and and as like some some kind of easy bludgeoning tool or um a game that talks about death in some kind of genuine way like you know you you have and no family members and you know they're not going to be around for much longer which which do you think is more evocative personally i think it's the latter but you know I hate it when people take their deaths so casually, but still talk about it all the time. Um, in this context, I don't mind it, but I have known people who are like, yeah, I'm dying, and and they, like, talk about it constantly. Like, I understand it's relevant, but, like, they talk about it, um, very s sadly, you know? I don't know. I've been waiting for you, Kai. Oh, sorry, let me get the voice. I've been waiting for you, Kai. You and I, who know each other quite well. You're not real. You know me. We've met many times, you know this. Uh, in dreams. You will make me prove it to you? So be it. I recall a heavy day just on the edge of autumn. 
waking, walking home from school, there was a gust of wind that felt blown from another continent. You saw, born upon it, a wisp flower seed which floated to earth like a snowflake. You caught it, saw its strange shimmer. You planted it in the little dirt pile by your window, and it grew into a plant that you swore sang a song just for you. No one else heard it. True, Kai? True? Yes. True. Good. Now, listen. The old man is dying. His pride has poisoned him. But there is a solution. Dracaena leaves. It is the only chance he has to hold on. Stay quiet. You will find the wide leaf of Dracaena next to the temple garden. Why can't you? Why should I trust you? No more denying. Stay quiet. You must get him Dracaena leaves from the temple garden. Seven gardens, mood is sung. Papu flowers for the flung. You see? What? That barely makes sense. Not everything can be easy. Use your brain, your ears, your eyes and hands. Now, the Dracaena leaves. Take them to him, Kai. Go. It be tough spreading negativity when I'm the one complaining about it. I I've, I understand what you where you're coming from, Neville. I've known that as well. It's it's kind of rough because it's like you know, obviously you care about people, you know, family members, and uh, you don't want them to to disappear out of your life. And, uh, they're, like, kind of, I don't know, talking about it without any weight. It's like, you know, you're the one who's gonna have to be, like, bearing, um, life without them. And in a way that feels more brutal than dying. At least to me, I don't know, I'm, I'm talking from my own experience. And so it's like you'd kind of wish that they just wouldn't talk about it as much. See you later, I'm a 10. Um, okay, we have the Dracaena, Dracaena leaves. Okay, I'm sorry. I am still feeling weak. I have something for you. You're kind of leave. Okay. Do you know what this is? Promise me you didn't eat any of this. Promise me. Of course I didn't. They're leaves. I mean... <laughs> Yeah, what's a salad, though? Forgive me. This is an extraordinarily dangerous substance if ingested. Express fear. What are you doing? They are also a potentially life-saving substance. Did I just kill you? I was dying anyway. Jakenna is a drastic option. One I was too weak to trust in. Until you showed me what I needed to do. I need... Grandpa? Grandpa, don't die. Oh, okay, not dead. This is even more stressful than looking after a toddler. I must sleep for this to work. We will speak more in the morning.
Um, I might just like I get oh. Uh absolutely no walking on these steps until the wood glue is set. Do you hear me? I've had enough of it. Enough. I need to get up there in the morning and I and to do that I need these steps. Yo, Dracula bug. These vibes are slightly darker than the previous vibes. Just wandering around. I, I probably need to just go to bed. Buggy friend. Oh, GLA is up and about. I am currently preparing a unique concoction. What does it do? There is a phenomenon known as vasodilatory syncope. Syncope? When ingesting foods that are spicy, the humanoid body diverts a blood flow to the skin in order to cool itself. A concurrent drop in blood pressure can cause temporary unconsciousness or syncope. Syncope? Syncope? Uh, sync? Syncope? Fainting because you eat something spicy? I am concerned about a humanoid named Bopex, ability to enjoy one of his preferred foodstuffs. I believe I can counteract the vasodilation by producing a substance to add to the hot sauce. The only problem is it is... It is... <laughs> It reportedly tastes nasty. So you're experimenting with flavors. Crisp blue bug extract is demonstrating potential. I must give more of my attention to my labor. Oh cool, this is like an extractor on a cooker, but for science. Magical vibes. I like that Jill A is just like a slime scientist and then meanwhile he uh he lives in like both a cave and also like a, a 60s vibe living room I should check my journal I said I'd call mom tonight she'll be back about now I think there's a phone in the bar all right going to the bar I think uh, once I end the day, I will call it there for now. Well, that did it. She'll see my side of things tomorrow. I'm not so sure, Pally. She told you pretty straight. She just doesn't know what's out there. Come on, you gotta listen to her. The burbs ain't her place. She got her bathhouse, too. She likes that work. She can work in a bathhouse in the city. A wonderful new life, full of adventure and grub. She's got to want more than this. All right now, maybe you've had enough. Don't want any more anyway. Gonna go home. Home to my beautiful boat. My sweet old bark. Uh, if she loved me, she'd follow me. You work on that definition of love you got there, Pally. What what happened to tongue the match between them and tongue? No 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 no. Do you want a game? No, supposed to play tongue. He didn't come. More practice is good. Why didn't tongue? Why didn't tongue show up? Tongue, why did you leave your friend? Let's uh, follow this up real quick. You got any love woes you want to share with us, Jitterbug? 
that she's got a string of boys, broken hearts in her bow wave. Enough, Grob. Um, you'd be surprised. He's had a bad night. Hey, I'm right here. Oh, Maury said not to forget to call your mom. Phone's right there by the door if you haven't had a chance yet. Yeah. Bartender seems like a good guy. Uh, boat tender, not so much. Hello? Mom? Mom! Darling, it's so good to hear you. How was the trip over? Captain was a bit weird, but it was fine. Is he nearby? Is that why you're whispering? Are you getting to know people? People have been nice. Are you sure? Talk about Maury. Maury took me to see him. She's very kind. Hope you're not feeling too overwhelmed. Are you managing okay? Oh, you know me, darling. I've lost my house keys five times already today. And burnt two of our three meals. Uh, I wish you could have come. I miss you too, but you're doing a lovely thing by helping your grandpa. Are you feeling okay otherwise, though? Talk about your hopes. I guess. I hope I can help him, Mom. Of course you will, darling. I know you, so careful and clever. Just make sure you look after yourself, okay? Maybe even have a little fun? I'll try. I wish you could have come with me. Oh. Love, I know. I just, uh... It's complicated. Nana was so angry at him. I'm not ready yet. But I know every everyone there will take wonderful care of you. But... Toby, no! Ugh, crayons on the wall. Sorry, honey, I have to go. But call like we said, okay? Thursday and Sunday evening. Love you. Okay, love you. Speak soon. Bartender seems wise. Let's talk to the bartender. He seems like a Grateful Dead fan. Well now, that was a bit of an evening. Let's get home now, though. Out of the rain. As soon as you're under Papu's canopy, you'll be okay. It's raining. Catch them lo-fi rain vibes. Wait, is this a plant I can harvest? I guess I already did that. Sleep vibes. I'm exhausted. Time for bed. Yo, rainy night. Good morning, sunshines. Mori is paying us a visit, aren't we lucky? I was just telling No No here how much better he looks. I knew your visit would make a difference, dear. The Dracana didn't kill you then. Kai has been very helpful. Did you sleep okay? You have everything you need? Be positive. Yeah, it's pretty... We are already firm friends, Mori. Don't you worry. Oh, no, no, dear. It's wonderful to see you looking so well. It won't be long until you can join me for morning Tai Chi again. Anyway, time to be off. Pop... And see, uh, pop in and see me in the stir fry at lunch if you get hungry, Kai, love. Bye bye, darlings. I'm sorry I interrupted you a little just now. Am I not supposed to mention the Dracana? Honestly, I didn't want to worry, Mori. She has been very helpful to me over the years. But I have to admit that her kindness is sometimes a little overwhelming. Will you join me? So you're fixed? Please sit. I can't thank you enough for helping me, Kai. 
Jucana was exactly what I needed. How can a plant just fix you? Your tea is getting cold. Now I am recovered, we must talk, catch up. Uh, I don't really like tea. Oh. Well then, no tea. <laughs> just talk. I wanted to talk to you a little about the role I play in the community here. Mom said you're kind of a healer. That is partially correct. Or rather, that is part of what I do. But the word they, they use here is shaman. Shaman? You come from a different world, Kai. Don't let it close you off to possibility, hmm? I'm sorry, no tea? She's more of a coffee girl. I want you to go to my hut in the crown of this tree and find my drum. Can you do that for me? A shaman drum? Please trust me. I know words alone will not suffice. So if you get the drum, I can show you. And that will explain things. Come back when you have it. And in the meantime, we mustn't let your tea get cold. How about I take care of that for you? Uh, sure. Okay, um, I'm gonna I'm gonna leave it there. Slight cliffhanger. I mean, not not really at all, but you know, it's fine. Um, I like this. It's uh, got some really chill vibes. What is what is gardens? Is this just like? Oh yeah, this is like the chill vibe <laughs> option. Oh my god, I'm, I'm not- I'm actually not kidding. We can just, like, plant stuff. This is really cool. You have, like, a limit. I kind of don't know what I'm doing, but I'm doing it. It's like the plants are singing. They did, uh, the, the, the weird crow person did say that the plants, um, sung a song for the, for Kai that only she could hear. Um... Crumples, bounces, memories. Not sure what this is all about. Tend plants. Select a plant. Salvage. Well, I don't I don't want to do any of that yet. Um time control. What is happening? We have a vibe control in this in this game. S seed sharing. Send seeds. To who? Generating. Oh, I can send seeds to other people. So if you play this game as well. Oh my god. Are you actually kidding me right now?
That's really cool. You can actually like send and receive seeds and then you can just like chill with the cool uh, plant vibes. Uh, I'm going to leave you all with this for a second while I go to the washroom and then we'll play some Katamari when I come back. Be back real soon. <laughs> 